Hi, I'm Apple. Welcome to Apple channel. Today, I'm going to present about present verb. Lost in your eyes, under your spell. Present verbs are very common in English, especially in more informal context. They are a matter of a verb and particle or sometimes two particles. The particle often changes the meaning of the verb. And today I will share a word break in a five words. Break away, break down, break up, break in, and break out. Okay, break or cause to separate into pieces as a result of a bore, shock, or strain. The branch broke with a rough snap. Let's go to see the meaning of them. Break away means exit from the control of a person, group, or practice. An attempt to break away from the item that has dominated the book trade. Breakdown means of a machine or motor vehicle suddenly ceased to function. His van broke down. Similar stop work ceased to work function go. Breakup means disintegrate or disperse. Example: The gray clouds had begun to break up. Breaking means forced entry to a building. Example: Would be thieves has smashed the door, locking and attempt to break in. Okay, the last breakout. Breakout means escape. A personal broke out of his cell. Similar escape form. Okay, these are the meaning of some of break words. I hope you learn some new things today and enjoy with my teaching. Thank you very much. See you next time. Bye. Hello everyone. Nice to see you. My name is Martin Yu. Today, I want to show you five ways to use the word "is breaking" in English. Number one, verb separate into places. It's meaning to separate into places. I sat on my glasses. Oh, but thankfully, they didn't break. Two. Verb. Breaking meanings that something doesn't operate or doesn't function properly. Why is my iPad not working? Don't tell me it's broken. Three, verb, suppress or do better than. Its meaning is to suppress or do better than something else. Have you seen that new movie? It's broken out the box office records. Four, adjective, very recent. As an adjective, breaking is very often used together with the word news, to meaning that the news is very very recent. I got breaking news notifications on my phone. Finally, as a noun, breaking meaning is stop working for a short time. It's time for breaking. So that's all I want sharing today. Thank you for listening and watching. Hello, teacher and all my friends. Uh, today I will share about Facebook verbs. Um, our Facebook verb is a uh, Facebook that is made up of two or three words. Of course, a verb and usually a. Uh, preposition. Sometimes it's a verb and all all the verb together. Now, uh, I will share about five um, Facebook <coughs> verbs. Our uh, first one, pass by. Pass by. It means 
go past without <coughs> stopping. It means go past without stopping. A bus has just passed by. A bus has just passed passed by. Second one, pass out. Pass out. It means disturb or noise consonants. Disturb or noise consonants. She passed out when she held the new. She passed out when she held the new. Third one, pass over. Pass over. It means ignore someone, something, or someone. Uh, ignore something or someone. Let's pass over his rubber mask. Let's pass over his rubber mask. Um, first one, <laughs> pass up. Pass up. It means refers to accept. Refers to accept. She passed up the opportunity to go to university. She asked. Pass up the opportunity to go to the university.、Mm, number five, pass down. Pass down. Um, it means <coughs> give <coughs> public to younger generations. Give public <coughs> to younger generations. She's going to pass her demerit down to her daughter. She's going to pass her demerit down to her daughter. Hmm. Um. Finish five. Um.、Uh, Facebook. Uh. Verbs. It's so important to know this <laughs> because uh in English we use Facebook verbs all the time. Thank you for listening. 拜拜。